Happy Wednesday, everybody. It's your girl, Dad, that Tarot, and I'm back for another tarot reading. Hold on one time. I had to lock these doors. Because, <laughs> you know, this will be full work and shit. So let's get into this mess, okay? So please like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so you can become notified of when I upload and when I go live, okay? And if you would like to book a private reading, all you have to do is um, email me. It's all in the description box. Let's get into this. Look, I keep trying to tell y'all, I do not like do girls, okay? And I'm on, at this point, I'm covering it just to prove that, look, this is do girl behavior. This is flunky behavior, okay? Because I keep saying, why won't Nicki Minaj go ahead and fight her own battles instead of letting these, instead of getting these girls, you know, putting, you know, batteries in these girls back to go after her. So basically what I'm starting to figure out, well, not starting to, I already felt that you got to go after Cardi B in order to be on a feature with me. <laughs> So this is another one. Now here go, here go another girl. Okay, here's another girl, Malibu Mitch that was on that feature. Okay, so she already got into it with Akbar. She got into it with JT. Who else? Um, Katie got bands. Ain't say nothing to her per se yet. She said something to um Asian doll, but we all know where it's coming from, right? Then now it's um Malibu Mitch turn. So Malibu Mitch act like she want to fight. Right? So now you look real stupid trying to fight Nicki Minaj's bottles. You look very, very dumb. Like, you do. Like, because I'm like, I would never, as I would never, as a grown-A woman, be so stuck up somebody's ass that I'm trying to fight for them. I would never. Let's see what this say. What this hitting on? Oh, it's a disregard. Okay. All right. So, anywho, I would never be out here trying to fight a gro another grown woman's battle. That is dick riding. That is funky behavior. That's straight up get with shit. And then y'all sound like bullies, but the problem is y'all minions, right? So, you're not an alpha. You're a beta for that. Some beta stuff. And But anyway, let's get into it. Um, anywho, so Malibu Mitch, now it's her turn to approach Cardi B, because, you know, they all got to go after her for some reason. Um, so basically it's her turn to approach her, and she's talking about fighting. So they talking about linking up. Cardi B, get go to the location like we outside. She out there, and, I mean, from what Cardi B was saying, Malibu Mitch was on the other side until she left, and then she went on whatever, right? So, I mean, so my thing is, does Malibu Mitch really want to fight Cardi B? And for what? And what's the energy surrounding that? Because, to be honest, like, we all know what it is. It's an obvious thing, right? Like, it's becoming too much. Like, because I'm like this, girl, if you, if you really, if it's that bad, Nikki, you, you talk mess to her. You put out distance to her. You at her. You link up with Cardi B and fight her. Why are you trying to get, like, <laughs> you do it. That's some punk ass shit. I'm a terror reader, but I'm also a hood bitch. That is punk ass shit. So let's see. Oh, I'm, oh, she trying to be smart. No, she looks like a coward. <laughs> but anyway, so what is the energy surrounding Malibu Mitch wanting to fight Cardi B? I feel like she got paid to go after her, or she got an offer. Uh, to what's the energy surrounding? The Eight of Swords. So Malibu Mitch is in a prison of her own making, of her own mind. And then the Eight of Swords is talking about bondage, right? So she feels trapped within her own thoughts, in her own head, in her own words, okay? And not only that, she feels trapped in this situation. So that's why she went after Cardi B. So why are you feeling trapped, though? You feel trapped, but you're not really trapped. That's you and your limited thinking. So you feel like you got to be in it because you was on the song. The mother of cups in the reverse. Okay, so this is somebody 
who is an emotional manipulator, okay? This is supposed to be a motherly person that wants to give you things because they love you. But also emotional manipulative stuff, it can be very well, I'm going to give you stuff to manipulate you to fill away. So somebody has manipulated Malibu Mitch to fill away. The six of pentacles, okay? And then not only that, Malibu Mitch got a problem too. She wishy-washy too. Matter of fact, I don't even think they had a problem with each other. That's the crazy part. She has emotional outbursts and she don't feel love. That's what it is. Somebody who's not feeling love. That's another thing about her too. And the six of pentacles in the reverse. So what does she owe a debt? She needs money. She feels like an opportunity was taken from her. Oh, so she got a vendetta against Cardi B. She has a vendetta against Cardi B because she feels like Cardi B got something that she don't. Or an opportunity was taken from her and it got something to do with her. But this is emotional immaturity, girl. It's very immature. It's very dumb. And it's about money. And the high priest is in the reverse. She was always a secret enemy of Cardi B. She was a secret enemy. She never had a pro. She never openly had a problem with Cardi B. Cardi B ain't even know she had a problem with her. This is secret energy, in, um, enemy type stuff. Okay. And then not only that, she lacks. Um, she doesn't feel like she can do it musically. Okay. She lacks confidence in her music. That's what Malibu Mitch is. Malibu Mitch is jealous. Or no, 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 no. Malibu Mitch is in her feelings because she felt like she lost the opportunity. And also, in this situation, she's in debt to somebody. Someone gave her something. Because usually, the Queen of Cups upright they will show you that they love you they want to give you things and things like that right emotional tokens of gratitude and stuff but in the reverse it's manipulated it's manipulation okay they're giving you stuff and now you owe them a debt to manipulate you into some into feeling a way so therefore malibu mitch is stupid she got manipulated into um Giving into those insecurities of what she isn't, and and for some reason, and some reason Cardi B took something from me. You got baited into that. <laughs> How stupid is that? I'm sorry. Stupid. See, look, set up queen talks about money, talks about balance. This is balancing money in the back of this. Somebody set you up, girl. This is set up queen behavior. Queen, I mean, this is this is the page of swords in the reverse. This that's somebody who set stuff up. Who's a shit stirrer? Who's a shit starter, manipulator? Yeah, you're dumb. <laughs> I'm sorry, Malibu Mitch, but you're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is the first time I ever just outright said somebody was dumb. Somebody was dumb. How can you set yourself up to be used like that? <laughs> How can you let your emotions be played with like that? <laughs> I'm sorry. How can you let your emotions be played with like that? <laughs> that means you're a follower. <laughs> Well, how does Cardi B feel about this shit? Because honestly, it ain't even because I'm rooting or not rooting for Cardi B. What it sounds like to me is, it's just a bunch of funkies. That's what y'all look like. Y'all really... Matter of fact, before I even go to Cardi B, how is this going to affect Malibu Mitch's career? Because she just looks like a flunky now. Like, she played herself. She played herself. She played herself for um Nicki Minaj. I I'm sorry. How does this affect... Malibu Mitch's career. Why? Well, so, because there ain't nothing gangster about being a flunky. I'm sorry. It's an imbalance in her career. The alchemy card. She needs to heal from some things. From past whatever you didn't get. You need to heal from that. That's that alchemy card in the reverse. And this hedonistic stuff. So, really, she's doing stuff and not even thinking about her long term career. She's not. She's just doing things that she thinks are good at the moment. 
the nine of wands, you're still, you're still going to be fighting the good fight, you know, defending yourself, defending your honor, defend, trying to, trying to keep pushing for your career. The five of pentacles in the reverse, this is going into poverty though, because the way these look, see, if it was, if it was all positive, you know, I'd be like, yeah, it's coming out of a financial situation. But this is going into one. I think with this five of wands in the reverse, I feel like she's going to have to stop being a flunky. She's going to have to end conflict. Um, But also, she's going to be known... For being a Nicki Minaj do girl, <laughs> I'm fighting for Nicki. <laughs> That's what it is. I'm fighting for Nicki. And Six of Wands is in the reverse. This is people gonna look at her fucked up. Okay, she thought she ate, but she didn't eat that. I'm sorry. And what? Okay, so what about Bianca? Why? Why she didn't um say anything to Bianca? Cause Bianca told her Bianca from Love and Hip Hop. You know, the chicken noodle soup girl. She told her that, oh, she, she, she still going to catch this fade. That's what she basically told Malibu Mitch. And Malibu Mitch had blocked Bianca and everything like she's scared of Bianca. Is Malibu Mitch scared of Bianca? One, two, three. <laughs> Did they fight before? <laughs> or is it that, um... You know, I feel like maybe it's giving the energy of I'm ready for round two, even though I got fucked up before. Oh, she thinks twice before jumping out there with her. You got the fool in the reverse. She thinks twice. And also, she also feels like, oh, Bianca just trying to come up and just trying to talk reckless. Okay. She just want to talk reckless because she want to be seen. But really, she thinks twice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she really do. Okay, so how does Cardi B feel about Milo Mitch? Because honestly speaking, she ain't, do, she ain't do nothing to her. Because I don't think that she ever had a problem with Milo Mitch. One, two, three. <sighs> Milo Mitch. She felt like Malibu Mitch, um, she keeps, okay, so Malibu Mitch comes up as the Nine of Wands. Her energy is the Nine of Wands, upright sometimes, reverse, whatever. But in the reverse, though, this talks about feeling vulnerable. Oh, wow. Being easily manipulated. She don't like this. And she's now upset. She's like, I'm not being treated the right way. Okay, so Malibu Mitch... Malibu Mitch is not being treated the right way. She's not being loved the way she wants to be loved. That's what is wrong with um Malibu Mitch. That's what that's what um Cardi B thinks, right? She's not um, Malibu Mitch is not being loved the way she wants to be loved. Okay, because with this nine of wands in the reverse, the Queen of Cups in the reverse, and the um Ace of Cups in the reverse, Malibu Mitch has a problem. Because she's not being loved the way she wants to be loved. And you have the two of cups in the reverse. And not only that, it, it she thought they was cool. Like, oh. She thought they was cool. So, oh, these secret enemies. Secret enemies. I got enemies, got a lot of enemies, got a lot of people trying to turn me up my energy. That's what they're trying to do. You know what y'all say that um, Cardi B does voodoo and rituals? You know what a ritual is and spell work is? They're doing spell work online against Cardi B now. Every time they attack her and they're writing out words, that's spells. So they're cursing Cardi B, putting spell work on Cardi B verbally, and then not only that, they're trying to drain her of her energy, her essence. I get that intuitively. That's what that is, okay? So y'all be talking about that. But see, the problem is when they can't beat you in numbers and money, or whatever the case may be, they can't beat you in that way. They can't, it's certain, they try to get other people to go after you. 
So, how does Nicki Minaj feel about Malibu Mitch going after Cardi B? She loves it, okay? One, two, three. She feel like, yes, Cardi B is defenseless. But the problem is she didn't give, oh, her stuff getting exposed. You got the seven of swords in the reverse. She set that up. She had something to do with that. But it didn't pan out the way that she wanted it to pan out. She wanted, she, okay, so I'm trying to tell y'all. So, she needed somebody to take up for her, okay? But the problem is with the three of swords, separation, heartbreak, distance, she wants to separate herself from this situation or, you know, because it's getting to a point. But not only that, it's because she manipulated these girls into going after her, right? With this Queen of Cups in the reverse. She don't feel love right now either. But Queen of Cups in the reverse, she gave them emotional favors to emotional, emotionally manipulate them. She gave them some things or she gave them opportunities to emotionally manipulate them. And her plan is being exposed with this seven of swords in the reverse and she feels like it's not working with this ace of wands in the reverse it's not working the way she wants it to work it's not working <laughs> no bitch that's because you gotta sit there and say something you go after her why don't you do it you don't get your millions you do it that's what i'm trying to tell y'all and if y'all barb say anything else other than that y'all i'm trying to tell y'all at this point it's dumb you do it. You mad. You do it. <laughs> you fighter. You battler. You do it. <laughs> so is Nicki Minaj ever going to step up like a grown woman and handle her own when it comes to Cardi B? Instead of getting these minions? One, two, three. The Sun card, yes. <laughs> And charging forward, all of it, and put her grand support into it too. Yes, and it's gonna be online. She's gonna be doing all that. Okay, so because all these other girls try to press Cardi B, and it didn't work how she wanted it to work, and people are seeing through it. Now she has to address it. Now she has to. Um, now she has to. Oh yes, yeah, she's definitely going to. And she probably got, oh, yes, and it's going to be a way to make money, okay? She's going to be dissing her on diss tracks. She's going to be sitting here um, saying it online, being clear. You better be clear, bitch, because you're starting to look like a little punk. <laughs> but, y'all, that's all I got, y'all. I'm so done. I'm so done. I keep telling y'all, y'all ain't have enough of this. Because, see, the problem is, y'all are negating the whole situation of bitch fight your own battles bitch you look like a punk bitch you look like you need people bitch everybody around you that's caught that's going after cardi b is a do girl and honestly speaking i call everybody bitches oh well take it but anyway on some real stuff this is outside of cardi b i don't give a damn but this on some real stuff this is a learning lesson for you ladies. Do not be a follower. Stop following people. Stop being do girls. Stop being pit bulls for people. Just because you feel like she's cute and she has money and she's the quote unquote queen of rap. That don't mean you got to be a disciple. That don't mean you got to be a follower. That don't mean you got to be a flunky. It's enough money out here for everybody to eat. Stop being so jelly. Stop doing all this stuff because it's just going to get, I already feel like it's going to get worse or whatever. It's dumb. But people are looking dumb. Do you know, Balibu Mitch, you look dumb. You look dumb. It looked like y'all trying to bait Cardi B off her, off her horse or whatever. It's like y'all trying to. It, it looks too desperate. It looks desperate. Yeah, I'm talking about you, Malibu Mitch. It does. You look desperate. But, okay, y'all. But it's a learning lesson. I love y'all for real. Happy hump day. Be blessed. I'll talk to y'all later. I love y'all. Oh, yeah, and book your private reading. And you know what? If, don't be don't be shy because I talk just like this in my private readings. I'm going to just go ahead on and tell you what it is. And if you look crazy, you look crazy. Okay? So, <laughs> I love y'all for real.